fixed cameras. Your successful completion of the demonstrated repair ultimately depends on the quality of your tools, the condition of your camera, and most importantly, your repair ability. Before getting started on this simple diode modification, see the Fixole Camera Video Nicromat FTN Top Cover and Prison Removal. With the top cover now removed, cut the red wire coming from the battery cable right next to the rewind shaft. Strip and prep the ends of the wire with solder and flux. Don't forget to slip a length of heat shrink uh, over the red wire before installing the diode. Insert the diode with the cathode pointing in the direction shown. If you should inadvertently install the diode backwards, it will not damage the light meter. You'll just have to unsolder it, flip it, and resolder it in the correct direction. Watch the Fixel camera video on a simple wire splice for some tips on soldering. With the diode installed, we check the meter by turning it on and off and then also adjusting the aperture resistor plate and we can see that the meter is functioning as it should. Now it's okay to slide the heat shrink tubing up over the diode and across the wire splice. With it in place, the hot tip of the soldering iron can be placed against the tubing and the tubing will then shrink around snugly in place. Do not leave the soldering tip in one place too long because it could heat up to the point where you end up breaking the connection and having to re-solder it. This particular camera is one of the easiest vintage cameras to do the diode modification to because the top cover is easy to remove and then there's plenty of room to place the diode and also the battery wire is plenty long enough to allow for manipulation and positioning of the diode once installed. Once the diode is comfortably seated all that remains then after testing is to install the top cover. Thank you for watching. Inspired? Check back for new video postings.